If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. It's time! Also, a quick apology. I just got back from high school diving. And I am feeling the chlorine everywhere. And so, obviously, you can tell that my hair is dry and crusty. So, to get that out of the way. Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Emery and today I have a super fun video planned. So, this is last year's advent calendar. I have had the same one two years in a row. And I'm going to be doing a gymnastics advent calendar. So, I'm not going to go through all the days. I'm going to go through five. And if you guys want me to do part two, I would totally do it. But yeah, anyways, we're going to go through five. I'm going to randomly select them. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And with that being said, let's just get right into it. One, two, three. Howdy. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. And hi, guys. because I don't actually have a blindfold. I should invest. Um, and I'm just gonna pull this like this. So sick. And I'm going to randomly select one. So, um, yeah. I hope you all can see it. I'm gonna go for this one right here. Number 17. Let's unfold to reveal our very first pose that we're going to be doing. Drum roll. So, our very first gymnastics pose we'll be doing a cartwheel. So, excuse my botched handwriting. Um, yeah. I knew. This one is pretty chill. I can, I can do a cartwheel very happily. Let's just hope I don't run into things considering I am facing my bed. Okay. Here's another angle. <laughs> All the most amazing angles. And yes, that was indeed a car wheel. So therefore our first one was indeed a success. Number two. Okay. You're kind of scared, but it's okay. Good spirits. Here's our calendar. And I'm gonna go with this one. Number 19. The splits. You know what? Hey, not bad. I am feeling very tight and very sore, so no stretching. Also, no, no preparations for this one. So we're gonna pretend like I'm fully stretched out, like I'm warmed up and I'm ready to do my splits. So I'm just gonna really easily. I'm definitely not all the way down. <laughs> I'm hovering. Come on, Emery, you got this. You got it, vibes. We're gonna pretend like that's very effortless and really easy, but I'm gonna tell you that it like really hurts. <laughs> so yeah, I kind of just ruined my secret, but whatever. That's not gonna be a success. I I don't I don't think. Oh. That was the most aggressive yawn. But yeah, failure. 
failure. Time for number three. People say third time's a charm. And I've already made this joke before, but like, the third child in my family is my little brother. And I would say that he is not the best, the, the third time's a charm kind of kid. I'm gonna go for the middle this time. I'm gonna go for this one. What was I even pointing at? 10? 15? I'm gonna watch that clip. So I did indeed pick 10. And for number 10, we will be doing a needle. I don't actually remember the last time I've done that. <laughs> okay, again, no stretching. So not really setting myself up for success here. Also, you have to have good balance in order to do a successful needle. And I have the worst balance. Okay. So technically, I'm supposed to be able to like strain my leg, but that might not happen today, kids. Second attempt. And that is gonna be the best you're gonna see. I feel so tight and that's no excuse. No excuse. New Year's resolution to be able to do a better needle. Now it's time for number four, our second to last one already. I know that there are multiple hard ones in here that I am scared about. Oh well. <laughs> it is on and I'm gonna go for this one. 11. Back handspring. I'm doing a back handspring. And the reason why I literally like died is because I might literally like die when doing this. I say that every single time. Like I get super scared because the only time I ever do back handspring is back handsprings are for YouTube videos or to like flex in class. Like I'll just randomly do a back handspring. So every single time it's, it's life threatening. We're gonna have to go downstairs for this one though, because I do not feel s I do not feel safe doing this in my room where I could hit my head and yeah, I could hit a bunch of things. So, welcome ugh, to my basement. Oh yeah, do you guys like my decoration? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just get this over with. I'm not stretching at all. <laughs> I was like, literally... <laughs> okay, just like a little bit, but like, just like a little bit. Like, yeah. I'm not even sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure how that's gonna help. Okay, three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh, I just got so scared my lash my life flashed before my eyes and i still did it so woohoo and now it is time for our last and final one so sad putting on the hat and i'm gonna go for this one just keep my finger on it number six The middle splits. Yeah. 
you know what's funny? I put that in there, and I most definitely don't have any confidence in my ability to do the middle splits. So, setting myself for failure once again. I have no room for this either. What, what am I doing? Okay, this is bad. But you know what's not better? My ability to do this middle splits. At one point, I like really tried to learn how to do the middle splits and tried to gain the flexibility, but this is as far as I can go. Like I'm really edgy drawing and Ow. every time it hurts so bad. Oh, that was a fail. Not a, not a very holly jolly way to end off. But I mean, overall, I feel like we did pretty well. I hope you all enjoyed. I definitely had a lot of fun filming. I will see you all next time. Bye, everybody.